brown lawn. Look how look how brown that is. That means how hot it's been, and it's still super hot today. And the day I'm filming this today is meant to be like one of the hottest days in Britain. So I'm up nice and early, and I thought I'd get it filmed outside, and hopefully not get too sweaty. But we'll see how we go. Um, but yeah, guys, welcome to my garden. So I'm out in the garden again today. I decided it'd be time to do another outdoor workout. But don't worry, this uh, workout doesn't actually really require any moving around. So if you don't have any garden space, don't worry, you can still do this inside in your own living room. And this one today, this exercise class, is just gonna be a nice, short, sharp workout today. Um, it's gonna be 12 minutes long. There's no warm up and there's no cool down. So it's just going straight into the main exercising part. I trust you to do the warm up and the cool down on your own because they're always important and you should include them in your workout. I've warmed up already. I'm ready to go today. Um, so yeah, make sure you are as well. Guys, this one is just sitting still. So like I said, you don't need any space, but you do need a broom or a stick for this workout. So if you want to go grab that now and then you've got that ready to go. And what we're going to do is we're going to do six different exercises and for each exercise we're going to work for a minute before moving straight on to the next one without any break so we're going to do six minutes in total in one block then we'll have a rest and then we'll do another six minutes so it's going to be 12 minutes in total um they're all exercises with the broom so you don't need to be picking it up putting it down you'll just be holding the broom at all times so i'm just going to quickly run through those exercises now so you know what to expect i don't expect you to remember them but they're just there in case you need them so the first exercise we're going to do is our broom in and out now we've done these quite a lot so all you're going to do is have your broom to your chest you're going to push it out in front bring it back to your chest push it up to the sky bring it back to your chest so you're going to out up out up and you're just going to do that as fast as you can for the minute we're then going to do some broom raises so with straight arms you're going to have your broom in your leg and you're just going to raise it up into the air and back down again up and down up and down and as you can see that will work a little bit your core as well because your core is trying to keep you nice and stable and balanced um broom exercise number three is going to be broom circles now we haven't really done these before all you're going to do is have your broom at like chest tight and you're just going to circle those arms around in front of you as quickly as you can i suppose it's a little bit like our hand cycling that we used to just with the broom in your hands so you're just going to pretend you're circling those arms as quickly as you can Exercise number four, we're going to go to our broom W's. So this is when you have your broom above your head and you're just going to bring that broom down behind your head into a W position and then up again, down and up. If you struggle to get it behind your head, you can bring the broom down in front of your face and up instead. Exercise number five, we are going to be doing our broom down, forward and up. Now we haven't done these before, so I'm just going to explain that to you now. You're going to start with chest height and you're gonna bring the arm down on one side, down on the other, forward and up. So you're creating like a little like a little square with your broom. So for example, you're gonna go down, down, forward, forward, up, up, down, down, forward, forward, up, up. And you're just gonna do that continuously and over and over for the minute. And finally, we're gonna finish on our sixth and final exercise, which is our broom paddles. So you're just gonna pretend you're paddling on the spot as fast as you can. Pretend you're in a lovely lake or something and you're, and you're paddling away. So that's all six exercises, guys. Hopefully they make sense. Remember, we're gonna do um, all six exercises in one block, so six minutes working time. Then you're gonna have 40 seconds rest and then we're gonna go again for a second, six minutes. I'm just gonna grab a quick drink. I'm not gonna lie, I'm baking hot already. This sun. I've kind of positioned myself in the wrong place, but it's a good, it's got a good background. So I thought I'd position myself here. But the sun is glaring in. I love it though, but it's just, I think I might get a nice sun tan here. See how we go. So are you ready? We're going to start off with our first six minutes. I didn't know where I was going then. And we're starting off with our broom in and out. So out, then up, out, then up. Are you ready? So we're going to go three, two, one, and off you go. Work as hard as you can. A minute on each exercise. Really good. That's it guys, well done. 
working super hard. Oh, nice breeze coming my way now. Really good job. And you are halfway through. You've done 30 seconds in this exercise. A minute is a long time. Really good. Keep those arms going. Super fast. Nice. And guys, in 10 seconds, we're going to switch on to our broom raises. So get ready to change in three, two, one, and off you go. Up and down. Really good job. Keep those arms nice and straight if you can. Nice and controlled, work that core. Really good. Halfway through. Stretch right up. This is hard. Really good, keep going guys. And in 10 seconds, we're gonna go on to our broom circles, which is exercise number three. Really good to get ready to change in three, two, one, and off you go. Remember, this is like your hand swipe thing. Circle those arms around the front. Try and keep those shoulders nice and relaxed as you do this. Really good to help. Keep that move. Nice work guys, and in 30 seconds, we'll switch on to our broom W's. I'll tell you when we're changing them. Oh, this is tiring. Really good, keep going guys, keep heading. And in 10 seconds, we're going to go on to our broom W's. So get ready to change in three, two, one, arms up and down. Oh, the people are balanced. Halfway through, you've done 30 seconds. Really good job, guys. Up and down. Oh, that's a nice breeze. Really good. You've got 10 seconds left on these. And then we're going to go on to our broom down, forward, and up. So get ready to change in three, two, one, and off you go. Down, down, forward, forward, up, up, down, down. Oh, it takes a lot of concentration as well. Really good. Sorry, I'm not talking, I'm listening. I'm trying to keep doing the right thing. This is a new one to me as well, I've just learned. And in 10 seconds, guys, we're going to go on to our broom paddles. So, three. Two, one, and paddle away. You got this is the last minute. Then you get a nice rest. Go, 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 go. Super fast. Turbo power. Go. Need a drink after this. Right, 
Really, really good job, guys. Well done. Just keep paddling. Paddle, paddle, paddle. Paddle, paddle. Really good job, you've got 20 seconds left. Final push now, then you get a rest. And a drink, more importantly. Really good job. 10 seconds to go. Keep pushing yourself, really good. Three, two, one, and rest. There, well done, really, really good job, guys. You can put your broom down for a minute, have a quick rest, grab a quick drink. And then we'll go and do all those six exercises for a second time. I might be regretting the second time. It's very hot. Very thirsty. Oh, it's feeling good. I feel like I can get my, get my tan on. Sun's out, guns out, eh? So this is a good one because this one, you don't actually have to move around your garden and um, you can do this in your own living room as well so it's perfect you don't need the space necessarily um, I just like to do a workout outside every now and then I feel it's more motivating it's nice to have the real fresh air around you even if it's hot it just feels good so hopefully you guys enjoy it as well we've got six more minutes to go and then we're done so see if you can hang on in there I'm basically giving myself a pep talk here because uh, it's hot so hot. I'm just telling myself six more minutes. That's all you've got, six more minutes. So we're going to start off with our broom in and outs again. So grab your brooms again for me. Remember, we're going for a minute on each exercise. Are you ready? Three, two, one, and off you go. Up and up. Really good job, guys. Get a nice steady speed that suits you. Remember, this is more about endurance for six minutes. Really good job. Nice, and in 20 seconds, we're gonna move on to our broom raises. Really good. And we're gonna change in 10 seconds to so get ready to change shortly. Really good. Three, two, one. And change onto your broom raises. I need to get my balance again each time I do these. Keep those arms going. Up and down. Really stretch up. Yes, guys, well done. Keep pushing as fast as you can. If you can go faster than me, go for it. Super hot here, so I'm just going to go at a speed that suits me. Nice, and in 10 seconds. We're going to go on to our broom circle. We get ready to change in three, two, one, and off you go. I like this one, it's my new favourite thing. Feels odd. It's good. So relax those shoulders as you do it. Keep circling. Oh, that was a loud bird. <laughs> really good, keep those arms going. Halfway through for 30 seconds. Great job guys, really strong. Just keep cycling. And in 10 seconds guys, we're going to go to our W. Is that exercise number four this will be? To get ready to change in three, two, one, and off you go. Down, 
and up, down, and up. Really good. Make sure you really squeeze those shoulder blades together as you do it. Like you're pinching a pencil there. Halfway through, well done guys. Down and up, get a nice good stretch up in the air. Oh, it burns the shoulder of ages one. And in 10 seconds, we're gonna go onto our down, forwards and up. So get ready to change in three. Two, one, and off you go. Down, down, forward, forward, up, up. Ooh. Oh, thanks so much for the space for this one. Up, up, down, down, down. Really good. This works with triceps as well. Triceps and biceps get them both at the same time. Really good job. And in 10 seconds, we're going to go on to the sixth and final exercise, which is your broom paddles. So get ready to change in three, two, one, and off you go. Last minute, push through it, go as fast as you can. I'm basically just encouraging myself. Really good job, guys. Keep pulling, go, go, go. Really, really strong effort, guys. Halfway through, you've got 30 seconds left. Final push now, let's go, go, go. Go to super speed. Really, really good job. I really, really love this one, it's so fun. Go, 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 final 10 seconds now. Just keep paddling. Really good, three. Two, one, and rest. There, well done, really good job. Oh. Well done, guys, you can pop your broom down. Really, really, really good job. Oh. Have a nice break. Grab a quick drink. And I want you to give yourselves a round of applause. Well done guys, really good job. If you've joined me outside, then welcome to the outside world. And I hope it's not too hot where you are. But if you've managed to survive it in quite a hot heat, well done, really good job. It's nice to do a short workout when it's this hot because you don't wanna overdo it. So make sure you drink plenty though, make sure you keep those fluids up. And yeah, that is your 12 minute broom workout complete. So really, really good job. Hope you've enjoyed it. I've loved that one. It's worked me super hard. I can feel it in my arms already. Um, so hopefully you enjoy it as well. Thanks so much for joining me out in my garden. I love it. I feel good. And have a lovely day, everyone. I'll see you again next week for another one of our little workouts. See you later. Have a good week. Bye.